The U.S. has a new public diplomacy chief, uh, former Discovery Channel CEO Judith uh, Mikkel. She comes to the job with experience in Africa and confidence she can help to boost America's image abroad. BOA State Department correspondent David Gallast recently sat, sat down with the new Undersecretary for Public Diplomacy. Secretary, thanks for uh, agreeing to come on the program. You are coming to this job of uh, Undersecretary for Public Diplomacy from a position of a chief executive of a multi-billion dollar corporation, Discovery Channel. I, I would guess that you'd be taking a pay cut to, to do it. Why? Why are you, why have you decided to uh, take up government service at this point? I led a company that was operating in 170 countries around the world. Um, I traveled extensively there. I met with government leaders and others. So I feel I have a really good understanding of what it's going to take to get this job um, done from sort of a first-hand basis, and I'm very much looking forward to it. Most recently, as you probably know, I also spent the past two years traveling extensively throughout Africa, um, launching an investment fund to invest in small and medium enterprises throughout Africa. So I have a lot of on-the-ground, hands-on experience um, doing this, which I hope to bring to this job. Does the advent of President Obama himself with roots in the third world, Africa, Kenya, uh, does that help um, the U.S. image? I think his um, administration clearly is going to help. His election clearly helped our image in the world in a number of ways. Um, certainly his roots in Africa, his, the time that he lived in Indonesia. He and I actually had a conversation about the fact that we both lived overseas when we were younger. And I think that does give you a different worldview. Um, so yes, I think the world right now is very willing to re-engage with the country. He and in his inauguration made an important point of talking about reaching out his hand. And I think there are lots of people who want to reach out to us now. And our challenge will be to sort of reconnect, re-engage with them, and use this moment uh, in time to sort of reestablish our relationships with people around the world. Again, at the end of the day, fundamentally, it's all about reaching out and connecting with people by, you know, sort of developing messages which resonate with them, understanding what motivates them, understanding their aspirations and their desires, and providing them with services um, and information that's relevant to them. Madam Secretary, thanks very much Thank for you. your time.